<laughs> yeah, you're right. And here we are in winner's finals. Starting it off with the... Uh, yeah, they're both just going to sit yeah. there and play a little footsies. Just like last week, man. Oh! That's All right, that was nice. Ah, yeah, it's not enough time to reflect it there. See, I don't know what else to say about these two matchups I, I haven't said in the past two weeks. <laughs> that was good. Well, because I mean, these two seem to always play each other. Yeah, I mean, they are uh, up there, some of the top that we have that ascend. So it's not surprising, but, I mean, the matchup really doesn't change or evolve too, too much. Especially because these two know how one another play. I mean, it's just a, a Mario changing and alternating between a really offensive rush play style and a defensive counter Gordo kind of, you know, poke and prod. Kurt always has played kind of defensively until he gets a grab and then he goes absolutely in for as long as he can maintain that and try and keep that momentum for as long as he can, obviously. But it's really hard to get in there with somebody. Yeah, yeah, especially on characters that are faster than him, like Mario. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Diego's now having a flood and GDD nearly at kill percent for another one of those uh, up throw up there down. Oh, oh my goodness. The F smash is definitely going to take that. Yeah, two options there. Getting your shield broken or getting. Either way, smash. no matter what he did, it was going to cost him a stock. That was a beautiful trap. Actually, maybe a spark dodge would have. I don't know. I don't know how you get out of that. That's a crazy situation to be in. Maybe we were fucked the Gordo. I don't know. Alright, well, King Per definitely brought it back from uh, being up say, like yeah. 80 to 20%. It's pretty crazy. That's the power of heavy hitters, heavy weights in general. Oh, yeah. The they hit comeback. like a truck. DDD having an added projectile is going to be a persistent threat under the. Alright, that was field. a nice shield by Per. Oh, yeah. Good timing, he was definitely going to come out. Looks like he was predicting that a little bit too hard right there, but there's no penalty to show him that. Alright. Okay, nice sort of shield. It's not going to do it. They were too much of the stage. Trying to fall with fair, but he still had a. He was probably. He was in the middle of get out. Yeah, that's going to do it. Yeah. That's going to do that's it. That's the way. Diego's really good about using that up smash and getting, make sure the enemy is right behind him so the first, yeah, yeah, the first hitbox connects. Yeah, fantastic space on it too, almost like to, where it's almost unpunishable by that opponent. Yep. All right. Yeah, it was uh, rapidly catching up. So it's uh, fairly significant deficit. Game seven there, man. Yeah, you. Especially with a combo heavy character like Mario, uh, DDD just need to rely on that to get out of their combos. Such a good just get off, you know? When he's been up getting married and whatnot. Down smash. Fastest Such smash a attack. bad angle yeah. to try to recover from that. Same thing. It has, actually, it's a very similar angle to Ganondorf's uh, forward tilt. Yeah, it, it really is. It. It's even a similar angle, just that Ganondorf's forward tilt's a lot less punishable. Than an entire smash attack. Yeah. The tear off to that is obviously it's a spinning attack, so it covers you know your roll option. Mm -hmm. Trade offs. Both really good moves though. Oh. As long as you. As Especially as you because get you can use Ganon's forward smash. Af, uh, I'm sorry. Uh, F tilt out of a. Flame choke. Yeah, out of a flame choke. Yeah. Yeah. All right, first game going to Perp, and now we're going right back into Neutralville. That's what we have for every other set played today, I think. <laughs> okay. Uh, after busting out a footstool on Crust, he's gonna do it again on BF. <laughs> Boy, that he gets anything out of it, it's completely irrelevant. Oh, that matters that he got a footstool. <laughs> uh. Yeah, goes nice mix up there. Looks like he keep perfectly getting back in on him. Nice fireball. Yeah, fireballs can really just send Gordos at bad angles. And Perp almost needs to land on him, but uh, yeah, goes hitting him out of that super armor. Probably as soon as the armor wore off, too. Great air dodge. And the best option is out of a right second, uh, the double jump. Perp missing that grab. Ooh, Gordo gonna. Um, no, but he's got the platform forward. drifting toward yeah. him. He's gonna use that to his advantage. That's hard move, too, there. Yep. They're falling with that back air. So, so deadly. Hey. 
Viecos is going to probably uh, die to any of the scenarios at this point. I think even the side hitbox on his dare is going to kill. I'll board them. <laughs> they were definitely at the edge of the stage. Crack him with that hammer. Edge of the stage. High rage characters. Wow, he's going to challenge that forward smash and still get away with it. That was, that was pretty risky. Yeah, that but was there. Risky. Too fast, man. If Viecos, uh, he would have seen that coming, they would have had to stop right there. And even then, the way it was going to look, it looked like it was going to hit the weak spot of Mario's uh, oh, yeah, that's true. It wasn't going to hit the The arm of the hitbox will send you at a different angle than the fire. Yep. Oh. Hey. Yeah. Two stock for King Perfect. Max Ray GDD is not to be trifled with. He is just feeling it today on stream. He's been on stream all day long, I'm taking I'm souls. I'm gonna go rewatch the stream. I'm gonna count how many stocks Perp has taken on stream tonight. I'm gonna guess 20 plus. Maybe 30. Who knows? I'd say 50, like in the 15 range right there. But then again, he was destroying it in doubles. I was you gonna got, say about three point. per match in doubles. Three. Anyway, all right, back, back to FD. For, uh, uh, Strange pick. I think that was uh, it was Vieco's pick that time. Yes. Huh? Was this Vieco's pick last game? Yeah, it was Vieco's pick. Why he chose Final Destination is beyond me. I would have thought he would have gone for Battlefield on the platform too. So, like, I mean, hey, if Vieco chose Final Destination, then that's his prerogative. Right? That's his player preference at that point. Almost came with the quarter there. But... Yep, full up there is gonna yeah. hurt. Wow. Oh, just mistimed that a little bit. A little bit earlier, he would have connected, and that does just so much damage. Oh, yeah. So much damage. What's funny these two polar opposites of characters fight is that, you know, Mario gets all these hits, and hit after hit after hit. And, you know, he's like, like it'll all be nicknamed. Yeah, and then, and then Kirk comes in with two back air, and that's the way you're at the Yeah, he can just take all of that hard yeah. work away. But man, does Mario look cool taking all, uh, That's true, all that that's true. He's got those style points going for him. Perp looked like he was trying to start him up until there, if I'm not mistaken, and it seems as though it wasn't quite fast enough. Oh, I mean, the oh, is just kind of deep himself. Ouch. And the downtown. Oh, no, it was, uh, yeah. It's the Lex, so what is it? It's the Crouch. unofficial taunt. The Crouch taunt. The best taunt. I don't know, man. I still think... My, my, my favorite taunt is show me a move. That's the most... What? That's... Shut up. No. He's just swing. Yeah, no. V Echoes is not going to punish the neutral special. That will smell death for him, especially because Herb can just shoot him out under the stage. And Herb will be perfectly fine. Even if he loses his stock. At this point, he can kill himself with, uh, you know, he's, 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 suicide tactics work well, no, not, no. not, not anymore, yeah. <laughs> and he's getting an open one. That always will take uh, your person just setting stop for 40 hours. Yeah. But well, be, that's inconsistent among character to character because it doesn't work with Bowser. Ganon's side does. I mean, Ganon's side does, but if you try I think, to... I think the GDD suck is, like, <laughs> random. That was almost real. That... Oh, my goodness. Millimeters away from Perp getting sent to the Shadow Realm in the third game of this uh, winner's finals here. There is a really good falling tool because it's, it's also a really good anti combo move. Check away and down tilt, not a bad option to get the other bombers back. Then he retreat, he uh, returns the uh, fireball right to the head. We're going to try and go for the grab mix up, but the Eclipse jumps out. Trying to get hit by the Gordo. Okay. Alright. 3-0. Oh. Now 